All right, legends, welcome back. So in the last video, we successfully racked our beer from our carboy to our bottling bucket. And yes, we can officially call it beer. It is no longer war. We have uncarbonated beer, but that's about to change. But first, we need to check out our final gravity because I want to determine our alcohol by volume. Now, you might have to auto siphon this if your bottling bucket does not have a spigot, but I got one. So I'm just going to pour it straight into my thermometer tube, what I used in the ninth video. So we're going to test it the exact same way we did it in our, in our ninth video, right before we pitched our yeast and sealed it with an airlock. Okay. So our OG or original gravity was 1.042.5. I might round that up just to 1.043. I mean, that's not exact. It's just me eyeballing it. Okay. So now our final gravity is about 11. So 1.011. Okay. So what, the heck are we supposed to do with these two figures well the proper formula is to subtract our og minus the fg and multiply it by 131.25 don't ask me why it's 131.25 it's just the way it is or we can just go over to brewersfriend.com or just google anything like abv calculator and something's going to pop up and then you just plug in your og and your fg and don't really worry about all this other stuff. Just keep the defaults the same. And there it is, guys. Okay, so our beer is just over 4%. It's got great, it's got very good drinkability. Okay, guys, so in the next video, we're going to add our priming sugar to our beer. And we're going to bottle it. And it's very crucial. It's very important that we don't over carbonate our beers because then the glass will explode like grenades. So we have to do it properly and we got to know what we're doing so i'll see you guys in the next video we're, we're going to add our priming sugar to our bottling bucket okay great job see you over there